Okay, I just seem to be getting more and more light out of less power. Today I'm using an overhead um, spotlight ceiling light. It's made up of LEDs and it's a yellow warm light. I'm using a simple transistor circuit with a 2N3055 transistor. Um, it's not a Jewel Thief circuit, although it does resemble it slightly. Um, but it's like a, a Jewel Thief on steroids. I'm using this air coil, it's by filer wound. Um, one gauge of wire is a little thicker than the other. And I've tried this with other toroids and different configurations and I um, get just about zero output of light compared to this baby. So the air coil seems to win. I'm using one AA battery and it's in a little step up converter here. And uh, I'll just spark this up so you can see the light output. That's the light. You can see it on the wall over there. So it's enough to reach that far. It's extremely bright. You can hear the coil over here humming away. I've got a magnet. You hear that high pitched squeal as the coil starts to resonate. Um, I just put that magnet in there so that it would squeal like that, but it makes little difference to the light output. And I've got a little potentiometer here. I'll just dial that up to full brightness. And uh, yeah, it's very impressed with the light output from that. So that's from one AA battery, you can get that much light. Now, I've just rigged it up to a 9 volt battery here. And uh, this way I can pick it up and show you the brightness I'm getting. There's the wall over there. It's probably about 10 foot away, up onto the ceiling. So it's like a 9 volt, and it's at absolute full brightness. You know, it's probably a little too bright. But anyway, I'm going to leave that running and uh, see how long the battery will last for. Now this is off uh, 3 volts two 1.5 volt batteries, very bright. Again, you can see it on the wall, up onto the ceiling. Extremely bright. That's off three volts. And here you can see 1.5 volts. I'll just plug that in there. And 1.5 volts, it needs a kickstart to oscillate, start oscillating. So, there we go. Once it's kicked off, it'll run. But uh, you can see the light there on my hand, right back to here. So, even 1.5 volts, you know, it gives a better production of light than the Jewel Thief. And in fact, that battery's a bit lower, it's fairly old, so. I think this is a bit of a jewel thief on steroids. Well, this has got me a little interested. I've got a simple AV plug here, Avramenko plug, and it's connected to a ground outside. It's a stake in the ground, less than a foot deep, aluminium rod. Now watch what happens when I touch. Only when I touch, when I touch it, I get this light from the lead. Now this can't be my body's capacitance, surely. Just going from me to ground through the lead. Um, what happens wherever I touch the lead? I've unplugged the wireless internet, the television, all electrical appliances in the room, and I still get this light emanating. So I'm thinking perhaps I'm picking up some type of frequency from the house mains. But um, yeah, I thought it was interesting. I'll investigate that a little more and see if I can't amplify it.